hey and thank you for clicking play on this it's my birthday yes so thank you uh, so much for watching um, and because it's my birthday I have treated myself to um, some cane fire maiden voyage there we go so it's a spiced gold spice rum a bit more syrupy than I'm used to comes in a triple pack um, so there's two more uh, in the series that I've, I've also purchased because I wanted these for ages and the other two will be set aside for the Christmas holidays um, and I would usually have this neat but it is a million degrees in here literally a million degrees I would prove it to you but I don't have a thermometer that goes up to a million so you just have to take my word for it it's a million degrees so this is going to be a quick video so that I can open this room back up again and let the aircon <laughs> flow through but cheers Here's to me, won't go too heavy on this because I'm going out with some friends tonight as well. So it'll be good fun. So it's birthday pickups. That's what this is. Um, and first and foremost, most people know this, but I, again, bought something, gave it to the wife and said, that's what you're giving me for my birthday. Because <laughs> you might as well with these niece things, right? Especially if you need to pre-order them. It's the Atari 2600 Plus. So that was my birthday present from Nikki, my wife. Um, still sealed still in the plastic haven't got around to opening it up yet um, I will do I absolutely will do of course um, probably need to move that which is a shame because because it's a shame mm. I've been out Christmas shopping today which is fine when you're in the aircon of the um, shopping center but when you have to traverse the concrete jungle of the car parks and stuff oh what a nightmare what an absolute nightmare. Anyway, 30, I don't know what it is, 30, 30 million. It's 30 million today. Tyra 2600, 2600 Plus, have no need for it, but I'm very excited to have it. Um, and along with that, as part of that Christmas bun, uh, birthday bundle, um, the paddles and more specifically the cartridge for the paddle games. Again, it's sealed, but I did notice it has or it can be open from the bottom, but everything seems to be there and in order. So that's fine. Um, so I've got that. Um, I, did, I didn't I did film it this time. I did go to the shop um, to, to EB Games again. I had them on pre-order. Went there and picked those up. Um, so I did get that experience. I've said before, I never had an Atari, um, original Atari 2600 back in the day. Always wanted one. Um, so I've kind of had a dual experience really. I've had the experience of walking into a shop and buying an Atari 2600 in 2023, which is bizarre and fantastic. But I've also had the experience of then unwrapping it on my birthday, which is equally as good because as a kid, it would have been given as a gift if we'd eventually got one. But we did get the Philips G7000 instead, which was great. <sighs> I've come to those last. So other presents from the family. I have from my son Luke Carcassonne so board games isn't something I've talked about much on this channel but we are a bit of a board gaming family and Carcassonne is or meeples as we call it um, my wife and I love this game and we're just getting more and more expansions so Luke brought us the tower expansion so thank you Luke looking forward to adding more complexities to an ordinary already in-depth game I love that game it, you can play it on so many levels uh, and, and enjoy it and then from my other son, Zach, and daughter-in-law, Erica, this is really cool. <laughs> and it covers two nostalgia bases. Potentially a dangerous rabbit hole, but I'll try and avoid it. And again, I asked, I, in this fact, we, we let each other know what we would like. And so, yeah, I knew they were getting me for And this is for my birthday and for Christmas, but they've let me have it for my birthday. It's a Transformers in G.I. Joe crossover. So you've got Megatron and he converts into a Cobra tank. Now I didn't have GI Joe growing up. I did have Transformers. I had Action Force, which is the same thing, but in the UK it was called Action Force. And this comes with the Baroness figure, and I certainly remember having the Baroness um, as one of the figures that I had. So this is really cool. I'm not going to go down the rabbit hole of recollecting original Transformers or Action Force or GI Joe or anything like that because that's just an expensive nightmare. But I like these reissue stuff. So just as a, as a fantastic shelf piece, I really like this crossover. Megatron, Cobra Tank, Baroness driving the tank. 
fantastic absolutely love that so thank you so much Zach and Erica that can go there and then there's only a couple more things um, which um, I basically bought these myself kind of so as I've as I've shared uh, previous years my mum bless her always used to get always gives us um, some money for birthday and Christmas this year was no different. She actually gave it to me in uh, when I was back in, in the UK in the summer, ready for birthdays and Christmas to distribute to the family. Um, and so what I'm holding in my hands here really represents the last presents from my mum. Um, and read into that what you want. Um, but yeah. So it's um, so I've bought for the Atari 2600. And so some of this was my money and some of this was birthday Christmas money from my mum. And it's uh, I've got the um, a, an enhanced edition of Berserk for the Atari Twenty Six Hundred Plus, and I've got Mister Run and Jump for the Atari Twenty Six Hundred Plus. And this is it's just amazing to be picking up again in the shop with my birthday money a brand new game for the Atari. 2600 in 2023 what a weird weird reality we're living and i love it i absolutely love it so that's really cool i love that yeah that's cool so obviously uh, i'll do a video on obviously those and stuff um separate videos um and especially mr runner jump um that'll be great um and on that, I think I'd like to say, you know, yay, happy birthday, me. Um, bigger one next year, but yeah. Um, and then, basically, I think on the back of things like this um, and what Atari are doing, I'm loving recollecting the games from my past and we'll continue to do that and you will have noticed I've slowed down a bit. I, th I think I want to hone it in a little bit more. Back to the Amiga and the Spectrum stuff um, a little bit more and, and the Philips G7000. And the acorn electron honing it in um but also um i think there's something really exciting and it's something i didn't think i'd get into but about modern games development for classic and vintage systems and so there's some really exciting games coming up for the like the cd32 the amiga 1200 stuff like that and so i'm going to keep an eye on those projects i'm going to jump into everything because money's not infinite um, but certainly something i'm excited to sort of expand um into um yeah i think it's a nice way forward all right thank you for watching and once again <laughs> here's my maiden voyage cheers thanks for watching happy birthday to me take it easy